Hey guys, have y'all seen the new Roblox avatars? I'm not talking about these right here. Everyone has seen these. I'm talking about this one right here. The, um, the it girl, the IT girl. <laughs> Damn! Yeah, that is a real Roblox avatar. Oh man, imagine my shock when I came across that on Twitter earlier this morning. You see, I was browsing Twitter when I saw, um, I, I saw this tweet here by someone named Red and he said, I can't imagine what the girls on Roblox are going to do. What does that mean? It's also funny, completely unrelated, that he took a screenshot of this because if you go to his bio and scroll down, it says he, him, 17, graphics artist, Single keyword there being single. <laughs> I just I thought I thought that was so funny. I don't know why. Anyway, if you go to the Roblox marketplace, go to character bundles, scroll down a little bit. Well, here it is, right here. IT girl 175 Robux. I'm gonna go ahead and buy this. All right, by Mark. All right, let's go ahead and buy this. Now it's important because it says in the description right here, use layered clothing. That is apparently very important. Now I'm gonna go ahead and make my avatar this bundle there it is right right there the avatar page is temporarily unavailable even roblox doesn't want me to do this let's go ahead and uh reset my avatar good god good lord you know i'm a little bit weirded out here because the head kind of looks like a baby but then you get you get to the body and um good god God, dude, like I didn't know the dump trucks came on the weekend. Now, what does this look like if I dress my avatar up as it? Let's put my hat on it. All right, good, good start. A few moments later. So, um, this is, uh, this is, this is what it looks like with my avatar, because apparently normal clothes don't work, which makes sense. Apparently we need layered clothing. That's why it said use layered clothing. So let's, <laughs> let's do that. Go to clothing. Let's go layered. Let's find a red flannel. We'll put the red flannel on. Find some jeans for the pants here. We'll go with these right there. Now I need a white undershirt. Um, I guess we'll go with that. And then, of course, some tennis shoes. And, you know, like, that's not, that's actually not that bad. I actually look pretty good, if I don't say so myself. I do need a different head though maybe something like like this good god i'm gonna get canceled look at that forehead oh my no that's not the only wild avatar that's come out in the past few months it's worth talking about i don't know if you guys have seen i don't know if you guys have seen these videos here these shorts these tiktoks this is the roblox snapchat game and people are um dressing up as scary, terrifying SCP monsters and then scaring children to death with those avatars. It's actually kind of fun because as you know, every Roblox game now has an age rating. So like Doors is all ages. The Mimic though, a little bit of a scarier game, it's ages 13 plus. You have to be a teenager to play the scarier games. They don't want kids being exposed to scary content or blood or anything like that. Roblox avatar bundles, however, don't have those restrictions. So you've got the long creep jam guy cobbler here and um you can just get him you can just buy him and go into any roblox game he's 175 robux we'll go ahead and buy that go ahead and equip it on our avatar here now i feel like this is where roblox kind of overlooked something because as you can see this avatar is pretty bloody pretty gruesome pretty scary looking but this is my avatar i've made it my avatar and now there is nothing stopping me from say going into a game like adopt me which is all ages, for example, and then scaring kids and little children with my um, bloody, gruesome, terrifying, definitely not suitable for all ages avatar here. Like, imagine I just run around kidnapping pets from little kids. <laughs> they see this avatar here and they just have like nightmares. But man, the Roblox catalog has gotten even crazier. I swear every time we make a video like this, something crazier happens than the last time. Like, you can just be a dog now. Like, like, literally, you can just straight up be a dog. You don't have to do any tricks, any glitches. You can literally just be a dog now. Or a, um, a prairie dog. 175 Robux, you know, for $2, you can be anything. You know, I really feel like we're entering a golden age of Roblox avatars here because as much as I've complained about these things, look, man, this is just funny. Bro, they even added in the rake. Oh my God. Like, you can play as the rake. Like, dude. 
That is terrifying. It said you can also recolor it. Is that true? Can I change the color of the... Oh my God, you can. Dude, this is crazy. So I could be like... I could be completely pale. Literally look like the rake. I could be completely red if I wanted to. Dude, I, I, I can't believe this is a thing. Now, with all that being said... This stuff is about to get even crazier. If you think the It Girl or the Rake is crazy, Public UGC is going to be coming out soon. Good God, it's a human starfish. And when Public UGC launches, Roblox is going to change forever. For the people that don't know what that is, basically right now at the moment, everyone who uploads UGC has to be approved by roblox you can't just upload a ugc bundle or item but soon starting in the next few months or so anybody on the website that has roblox premium will be able to upload ugc items avatar bundles characters hair faces anything and so if the catalog looks like this now silver fart chain <laughs> love that oh my god they have a they have a golden riz chain oh dear god just imagine what this is going to look like once public ugc comes out honestly i'm a little bit worried is this going to lead to a situation where roblox can't properly moderate things? is this going to lead to a situation where I don't know if you guys remember all those years ago, the music situation. Back in 2022, all the Roblox audios got removed due to concerns about copyrighted music being used without permission, along with other things. What happens when Mega Ohio rizzed up Giat Godzilla stumbles into a dot me <laughs> with blood <laughs> dripping all down his scales? It's going to be a very crazy day. I'm, I can't wait to make a video about it. A few months ago, I was like, dude, this is terrible. Roblox needs to fix this but like but i am beyond caring at this point it's clear that roblox doesn't really care that much at this point so if they don't care why should i care we're gonna have some fun with this we're gonna get crazy dude and on the topic of the it girl i know i like making jokes about it and everyone on roblox does but i mean it's really not that big of a deal this is just women this is how women look i don't know if this was uploaded to be sussy wussy or if it was uploaded to be a realistic proportion, you know, woman avatar. I'm sure some people are going to use it in inappropriate ways. But like, look, man, this is this is just how people look. All right. It's, it's really not that big of a deal. It's not that big of a concern. Like if you were to walk outside your house right now, go to the store, Walmart, whatever. This is just what a normal woman looks like. Like, I, I mean, she's a little hunched back a little bit like her posture could be a little bit better you know what i mean but like okay well she has a bald spot but i mean besides that this is just what a normal person looks like i mean the face is a little bit weird but like i mean it's roblox what you gonna do this is, this is just this is just normal it's normal provided people don't use it the wrong way which considering roblox is you know um a lot of there's a lot, a lot of children, a lot of teenagers, a lot of a lot of inappropriate kids out there. They may they may do just that. Let me know your thoughts down below.